Hi everyone. Today I will show you how to make this blanket stitch. I can call this brick stitch. Um, it's kind of uh, look like big waffles, uh, but that's easier. Uh, we will only use a uh, single crochets and uh, triples. And uh, you will see you can make it easily, even a beginner can make it. Um, for this one I use cotton yarns, worsted weight cotton yarns and 4.5mm uh, hook. But now I will use wool, it's worsted weight again. And with them I will use 4.5mm hook again. If you are ready, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. We can start now. I will start with a slip knot and for this stitch we will need multiples of six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Make this chain loosey. Hi Chaco. Hello. Let me count. I made 26. Now it's 24. That's enough. It's multiples of 6. Now um, turn back. Skip this first stitch. Insert into the next stitch. Grab the yarn, yarn over and pull through from two loops. That's a single crochet and we will keep making single crochets. And I will put um, single crochets for all the chains. See you at the end. Say hi. Say hi. Do I miss you? Don't you miss them? <laughs> He's just too shy. Okay, I will complete my um, chains and turn back. And in the end, I have 23 uh, single crochets. And now, chain one, turn. Insert into this first stitch here. Make a single crochet. And keep making single crochets. At the last stitch, insert, grab the yarn and don't complete the single crochet. Take the color B and complete the single crochet with it. If you want, you can make a um, knot here. Okay, chain one, turn. And I will not cut this yarn and I will hide this tail while I'm working. I will uh, work uh, with this yarn. I will carry uh, this one and this one too. Okay, never cut the yarn. Insert from the first stitch and make single crochets. around this tail too. This way we will hide it. Uh, 
and keep making single crochet rows we will make totally four rows with the lighter color I could show you like that we have four rows here I will make two rows and then I will show you when I reach it I, I will show you how to carry the other yarn with us okay I'll make two uh, rows and turn back to you I'm at the end of the row so I haven't completed this last stitch okay now I will grab the first color and make it like that grab the same color I use complete the single crochet then grab the first color and take it to the first place then chain one and keep making single crochets I will show you one more time this um, this way we will carry the yarn okay I haven't completed the single crochet grab the yarn take it in front of the other color complete the single crochet then grab the same yarn hold it and uh, put it to the first uh, position chain one turn this way there will be uh, here will be more clean but of course you don't have to make this uh, you will just make your single crochets then you can take this one at the end of the row four uh, you can make it like that because if you are making a blanket or anything um, you will make a border and you can hide them as you see I hide them with single crochet only single crochet so that will be no problem keep going make two more rows now I'm at the end of the row here I will change the color grab the second color first color sorry complete the single crochet with it chain one and turn and now uh, we will make um, five single crochets we will start to make our uh, stitch now make five single crochets and here we will make a triple yarn over twice if you want you can yarn over third time too we will make this one so loosey okay just you can see this empty stitch just go like that and around this stitch uh, five rows below uh, it's one two three four five if you count this one too it's sixth stitch look one two three four five and sixth insert your hook around this stitch Grab the yarn, pull through two, pull through two, pull through two. Okay, make it as loosey as you can. Then uh, we will skip this stitch behind this triple 
and starting from the next stitch make five single crochets one two three four five yarn over twice you can just go like that or you can um, uh, um, count one two three four five and that's the sixth stitch and this stitch one two three okay skip this one make one two three four five yarn over twice one two three four five six insert your hook around it one two three skip one one two three four five chain one turn and we will make single crochets for one more row one two three four five and make the sixth one into this uh, triple stitch keep going like that and complete the single crochet row that's the last stitch I will insert here and grab the fur, uh, second color sorry chain one turn and now uh, we will make single crochets for four rows again like we did here I will complete four rows and I will carry this yarn like I show you before see you at the end of the uh, four rows I'm at the end of the four rows and I will grab the first yarn first color chain one turn and with this with this color we will repeat here now make five single crochets in a row one two three four five it's so easy right now we will make just a second we will make um triples but now it's so easy we will insert here we will make it around this uh, triple it will be a front post triple insert from here make it even loosier skip here make five single crochets yarn over twice around this triple make a front post triple skip it make five single crochets yarn over twice make a front post triple skip 
skip this one and make last five single crochets. Chain one, turn, and one more row with this color. Five, six, and keep going. Finish this row too. Now that's the end of the row. I will cut the yarn here, but for this one, I will turn and make one more row with single crochet. Okay, then turn, make single crochets here, here. I use stitch for here and here, but these sides I don't have stitch, of course. Um, I only make one single crochet for uh, these two rows, and for these four rows, I made three single crochets. Like you can make it like that, you can put one here, two, and three. And for here only one and it will look like this one it will look good then you can make the border as uh, you like or you can just use single crochets for the border and um, uh, for the corners you can make two single crochets for this last stitch here and here, last and first stitch, and that's all. I could hide this tail, and use it. I think uh, you can make, you can use this stitch for baby boy blankets. I like to use waffle stitch for uh, boys. I think that will look uh, good too. That's all. I hope you like this tutorial. If you like, please thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Since crochet is my Instagram address, you can reach me there. That's it for today. Hope to see you again. Have a nice day.